Chinese fairy tale, a foal crosses the river. On the bank of a small river lived a happy horse family. One day the mother said to the young stallion, Ming Ming, you are old enough to help me with my work. Can you take this half sack of wheat to the mill across the river today? Enthusiastically, the foal reared up, yes, gladly. No sooner had the mother finished explaining the route and the task, than it was already dashing away at lightning speed. Oops. When the inexperienced little horse realized that far and wide there was no bridge over the water, he was taken aback. How do I get across now? wondered Ming Ming. Not far from the bank, he observed a buffalo grazing. Ming Ming hastily galloped to the buffalo and snorted, Hello uncle, can you tell me how to cross the river? The buffalo slowly raised his head, stretched out his right front hoof pointing, Oh, very simple. The water is not deep at all. It only reaches up to my lower legs. Feel free to walk across. The boy beamed, trotted back to the water. Just as he ventured into the water, a loud cry suddenly rang out, Stop! A little squirrel rushed energetically toward him. The water of the river is very deep. One of my buddies fell into the water two days ago and was carried away by the current. The colt was out of ideas, he didn't know what to do. The buffalo said the river was shallow, and the little squirrel said the river was deep. What am I going to do now? I have to go back and ask my mother, the young stallion decided. Ming Ming trotted back to his mother with his head hanging, sobbing as he recounted the words of the buffalo and the little squirrel. The mother comforted the child and replied encouragingly, It doesn't matter what others say, let's go to the river together and see for ourselves. The boy and his mother got to the river, and the mother asked her child to test the depth of the river with his own legs. Ming Ming carefully groped ahead and gradually crossed the river. Aha! The young horse finally understood that the river was neither as shallow as the buffalo had said nor as deep as the little squirrel had claimed. So you only learn the truth when you try things out for yourself and get to know them. Lovingly, Ming Ming looked at his mother, thank you, dear mom. Then he turned and trotted neighing to the mill, the foal felt happier than ever. Thanks to his mother, the child found his better self by learning to trust himself and his inner voice.